all right hello you're welcome to Chris graphics tutorial um, today I'm going to show you how you can do a gradient transparency on images on images that's what we're going to do today all right but before we start if you're not subscribed to my channel make sure you hit the subscribe button right now hit the like button if you're going to like what if you like what you're going to see and then turn on the notification bell very important so that whenever I upload new videos you will be notified immediately all right we upload videos every week every Friday um, educative videos very quality videos that will help you in your graphics design career you can check the description of the channel for more information so if you're not subscribed please subscribe hit the subscribe button right now right if you're new hit it if you're not new if you're not subscribed hit it if you're not turned on the notification bell do it all right all right thank you thank you very much thank you very much um, for doing it right now all right so what you're going to do now you are going to um, add transparency to this image right now we don't like what we've seen here we don't want it to be as sharp as it is here so we want to make it fitted with the background all right it's very simple to do and um, you can do it across uh, many backgrounds background colors as possible because um, pixel is actually designed um, to help you achieve that all right so this is what we're going to do click the plus sign click shapes and then all right here now this is what um, we are going to do here so when when, when you click the shape the shape um, you you can choose any shape you want to use um, but um, most often we we actually um, use um, a rectangular shape or a square shape something okay so scroll down to where you see color click gradient so this gradient now allows you to add um, add multiple colors all right to a particular shape in various forms you can see um, some of the gradients I have here already um, this is where the recent ones I created all right so um, you can click click this plus sign because of the background we have click this plus sign and then you can see how it is you can decide to change them from here you can change it look at look at this one look at this other one look at this one all right so you can you can actually be, um, decide to change look at how they are all right um, you can decide to add the rhythm from the center okay let me just try what i'm saying from the center you can see what's what's happening you can actually move from here uh, like this so this is actually um i i'll, I'll give a tutorial on this late, later later i'll give a tutorial on this later so um let's go back to what we have all right so you come and click um click this 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 place here um this place is actually the one on the top you're talking about this side all right so this is the one you click if you don't click it whatever you're going to do now is going to be below all right so click it first then once once it's clicked click the uh, color sign and then move your color uh, uh, move this to transparency set this to transparency you can see you can see um, the color code over here this is zero move it until it becomes zero all right you can see the difference it's 255 move it everything is 255 that means everything this is white this is actually white so move it until you have zero for this transparency over here all right uh, let this become zero all right then hit ok then because of the color we have a white color there click this one over here i mean this one click it and then click your color again and then set it white let everything be two five you can see it hit okay all right you can see that um it's actually faded from here downwards you can decide to move it gradually down depending on what you want all right uh okay this is actually a cyclic transparency so um all right i've changed it it's not cyclic again so it's here you can change them from here this was the one i, I clicked just now all right so uh, so you can decide to move it depending on what you want all right so uh let's leave it like this and hit okay all right you can see that um it's faded so you can enlarge it all right so you can see that um, it's still showing so what you're going to do is actually quite simple what you're going to do is um see the plus button again and move this up you understand my point move this up and then hit okay you can see if if it's still not okay for you you can see hit it maybe move it down drag this up so you can do your settings the way you want you want it to be or to the, to the, to the point uh, where it gives you the best results all right hit okay you can see what you have over here all right so what if you have other colors uh, maybe one other color or color um that is not white it's very simple to do all right so uh if you have a color that is not white it's simple to do like i've said so you um let's change the background color to 
um, this one all right so if the color is this all right click this you can change the color of this to you can also change the color of this to that particular color and it will go where all right you can see it so um, anyhow you want to do it this is how you can actually achieve that gradient color so um, I believe you you have learned something today so if you like what you saw please kindly subscribe to uh, my channel thanks for watching